<laughs> Unconditional love, support beyond belief, making me have more confidence in myself, showing me how to be a man. He just doesn't come to my basketball game. He's present in every portion of our life. If I was getting a certificate for honor roll, he was there for that. PTA meetings, he was there for that. I had to move from home to Worcester, Massachusetts. We packed all the stuff up and he drove us the entire way. But when I got into trouble, he was there. Some people leave you hanging when you get put in negative situations and he was the one that helped pull me out of them. I can't remember something that he wasn't there for, be it good, bad, or indifferent. My wife and I, Luis, we were married 10 years before we had Jared. We had ample time to make adjustments to adulthood, let alone becoming a parent. I'm the oldest of 32 grandchildren, so I had a lot of practice in being responsible for someone else's uh, upbringing. My wife and I work in concert to make certain that they understood the balance of life. And that's the most powerful thing that a person can do for children is to teach them social skills and how to share and understand each other's uh, ups and downs and differences. My dad was like a dad to everybody that came in contact with us. I was blessed with two of the special ones, parents that didn't, they didn't have to do that. They didn't have to go out of their way to help raise other people's kids. They had two kids that were problems enough, but they did it, you know, and, and made it look effortless. It's kind of hard to act like you don't know how to be a good person if somebody is showing you how to be a good person every day. So his example is invaluable because there's no excuses after somebody has taught you how to be a great father and a great husband and a great person. He's like the cheat code. He give you the answers to the test that you already about to take. So you really, you really don't have much of an excuse to fail this exam. Did I do that? Yeah, that's like the dude, <laughs> that's like the dude failing the open book test. Right. Yes. It's on page eight. Right. How you do that? <laughs> Hashtag, Hashtag everyday dad.